How are you doing YouTube and welcome back to the end of Skyblock episode 24, can you believe that? So today what are we going to do? I think we're going to do something a bit mundane and boring but has to be done. Um, we are going to start working on the squid farm. Or it's going to be kind of squid, mainly for fishing really I guess. Um, because we need not so much the squid, we need, uh, we could make a really, really rubbish pool of water, but I want to make this epic. So I want to do two birds, one stone with this. Um, there's two problems with it's going to happen where I'm going to be positioning it, and I've, I've come up with this off camera. There's going to be two issues, and I need some more food because I've only got a little bit left. I'll put the relics on the wall, by the way. Um, not really been doing much off camera in between this episode and last, just probably feeding cows. Actually, I better go and check the mob farm because they're probably leaking everywhere. Because I've just log logged in. Oh no, oh yeah, we've got a skeleton over there trying to take me out, but uh, he can stay there. Um, so yeah, we've got the uh, block of flats over there. And I've literally, off camera, I've, I've made another block of flats. So I'm not going to show you over and over again the same thing on camera. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make this into kind of a like there's going to be some here, there's going to be some here, there's going to be some here, and there's going to be some here. So kind of like a a square. I'm going to call it Albert Square. It's going to be amazing. How you doing? Yeah, grumpy today, aren't you? Oh, I don't have that. I thought col uh, charcoal would work. They haven't been breeding actually. Maybe I've got to start. Maybe they now class this as their home and I need to go upwards because you can go upwards and it makes them breed eventually. So I'm not seeing any babies or anything. So yeah, I don't really know. So anyways, so this is going to be the start of the pool here and we can be able to walk around it. So what we're going to do is we're going to go and grab ourselves some blocks and some food because my food seems to be getting a little bit low. And, yeah, so how have you guys been? Are you enjoying this series? How are you, how are you doing? Uh, I must have recently done this last time I was on. And, I don't know if I showed you, but the sign's back again, working. What we got in here? I'm just getting it. I haven't really been on this map very much recently, um, because I've been waiting on the series to catch up, and now we're pretty much catching up. Um, so, yeah. Oh, I haven't finished the tree farm yet. <laughs> I'm really bad at that. I'm so bad at doing projects and I'm not even finishing them. What have I come out here for? Not to go that way. Building blocks. So we're going to need a hell of a lot of you. And we're going to need some of you for now. And that's pretty much it. And some food. I'm going to eat some food now, just to top me up. 74 levels of experience. That's mad. That proves that I haven't actually died in a while. Look at all this beef I've got. I know that the I'm saving the um, pork chops actually. Speaking of which, we're going to go and feed them as well. Um, we're going to feed the chickens because we need chicken seeds. Oh, we only have one chicken, don't we? That's why I haven't done them. Uh, I'll sort that out another time, but I will feed the pigs. I'm pretty sure none of them are accepting beef. I could be wrong. I better take some beef just with me, just in case. Um, let's let's feed them as well. Uh, so far, the chicken hasn't glitched in, in several episodes, which is good. Come on, then, feeding time. There you go. There you go. And carrots for you guys. Come on. Yep. 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 There we go. Oh. They're getting, they're getting a bit fruity around there. Okay. Um, is that skeleton still here? I think he's despawned. But um, yeah, so not a lot has been done on this map. I mean, I have, I think I messed about with it a couple of days ago. Um, just bit starting to build the flats. Oh, I need food. Actually, I'm going to take some steaks, see if he actually wants any steak. And I will eat melons because we've got like loads of them. Um, yeah, so I was, I come on for a couple of about an hour I think and I built the second lot of this which is over here I'm definitely going to call it Albert Square I think it's that's a cool name for it where's the butcher fisherman there's a butcher around here somewhere where you go you would be down here wouldn't you somewhere 
I reckon you're down, all the way down here. Oh, there you are. Are you the butcher? Oi. <laughs> the rudeness. Where do you go? Where do you go, son? Butcher, here we go. Right. You're not selling beef. you got to be joking me. Uh, oh, you don't want to buy beef. Okay, so I'm carrying beef for nothing. I don't actually want to carry this beef for nothing. I thought he, was, he had beef. Have you got beef? You're a librarian, so I doubt it. Okay. I'm going to put this beef away because that's a good source of food. And none of them want it. I've got loads of it. And I don't even have looting. That's how many times I've been breeding and killing those cows. Okay, right. So, let's get on with the project. So, we are going to start from... Actually, we, we might as well map out our... Our, our thing okay let me just let me just try and work this out okay so that is going to be where the pond will end I guess yeah because we need to go out this way anyway all right this is going to require some mathematics okay we'll just make sure we don't fall off and I'm keeping this really well lit. The last thing we want to do is have an accident with zombies. Oh. Or placing slabs. Okay, so I do believe that that is... I've got... I need to think about this a little bit. Because I want to make it symmetrical. You know what I'm like. So if we're... Yeah, if that's the corner, we go out three... And then, yeah, okay, I got it. Go out three, okay, and then, is that three? Yeah, and then, here, is where the next block of flats is going to go. So, pretty much, here, this is where the next block is going to go. I'm pretty sure one, two, three. So that can go then, because that's that's too much, and we've gone far too far out. So we've gone four out. We don't want to go four out. I'm really concerned for this villager's safety. If you want me to be honest, because these guys have no, they don't care. Okay, so let's let's just count this. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-one, and that doesn't include the path. So we want to go from here, and we want to go twenty-one out. So let's just mark this as the first bit, okay? So that's going to be what uh, one. So one, two, three. Four, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, I don't like this. Eleven, eleven, <laughs> twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. You can fast forward this bit if you want. <laughs> 19, 20, 21. Okay. We want to slam some torches down because we don't want any guests that are not expected. Okay. So that's where they start. And this is where the pathway will end, roughly. So let's just quickly get this going outwards. Oh, such fun on Skyblock, isn't it? It's got to be done, though, and it's kind of something to build on camera. Because, unfortunately, I don't really have any other ideas of what I can be doing apart from just managing cows and stuff. Okay, so that's the first one. Uh, what we'll do is we will block off this for now. Because this is going to be the pond area this that is one big ass pond though and it? it's going to be massive 
Um, so what the deal is, is the, f actually I'm probably not gonna make it that big. I'm probably gonna make it, um, I don't know. I'm gonna use this space the best I can, I guess. Maybe decorate it some. Okay, so we are in line with that. Look at that, beautiful. We look like we're in, sh in good shape. And we're gonna take that off. Yeah, we're in good shape. I could have just looked at that one. I don't even know why I didn't do that. So we need to go out four now because the buildings are now four wide. Two, three, four. And we need to just quickly fill this all in. Which won't take too long. The only trouble is you run the risk of spawning zombies. Now those zombies will head straight towards those and mess up everything. If we get any zombies in this area, we are done for. Because I'm not joking, we will have to work hard to get our villagers back. Because um, it was pretty tricky to get them here in the first place. Not as tricky as I've had it in the you know in the past. In the past, it's you know to get villagers for iron golem farms and stuff like that. Extremely tricky. Extremely tricky. So let's just go this way. Which means, actually, speaking of iron golem farms, that's something I'm going to have to look into getting at some point because relying on the mob grinder for iron is extremely hard work. You, I mean, zombie drops, you know, there's a very rare chance that a zombie's going to drop um, any... I think I'm going to just leave that pathway here as that. Oh, I keep putting it in the wrong place. I'm rubbish. And... Yeah, so the the grub the, the mob grind is all right, but it won't like it won't. It's not like the final like I don't know choice of getting iron. Uh, an iron golem farm would be the best form to do it. Um, the only trouble is we only have one source of lava, so we can't really go down that route. One blade of lava is not really enough. I mean, we can't really get any others, can we? I mean, this stuff look cool though. Look at it, it's amazing. You got the farm in the background. I am kind of going around the farm. The farm looks cool from here, roughly. I should have had that higher up or something, or lower down, so you can see. Um, have we we've run out. Have we run out. Okay, I need some more. We need to make some wall, more walls. So yeah, I'm not going to probably make it that big. I think that's a bit OTT. I'll make it a reasonable size pool. So with squids, um, squids spawn anything from 63-ish to... Or is it 64? One of the two. Um, all the way down to like Y40. So we're going to make a pond that big. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Probably use a stack. No, use two stacks. That's another thing I need to do on camera as well, is, or or what have you, is build a better one of these. But eh. let's see how it goes. I'm taking a lot of cobble, which I don't really have much use for right now. However, we need a lot of these walls. Is it me or these turn? They've turned this round in the hot bar. I don't know if it was a bug, but I saw that in one of the snapshots because we're still using snapshots. It's, um, I can't remember what, off the top of my head. This is the latest one, fifteen W thirty three B, uh, latest at the time of this recording. Anyway, um, yeah, the steps on the on the hot bar was the wrong way round. So it was kind of really weird. It felt weird. Okay, there we go. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're just going to plonk these here for extra light. You never know. We're not taking any risks here. I'd rather be over over cautious with light than than not. And look at this. Excellent. Oh yeah. Cool. So this is where our next block of flats is going to be. It's not the final one because we're going to have one final one going down here and then we're going to go upwards, which it will block the view to the um, 
grinder over there. I might just make it a couple higher and then leave it as that, so just for view. Uh, I'm not 100% sure yet, but I could just go to town. I think you can make this go as high as you want. And uh, yeah, eventually they will breed like mad. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much that one sorted. I'm not going to build the other side. I'm pretty much going to... You're getting the idea. I'm going to pretty much build the other side off camera, I reckon. I'm going to mimic this. I'm going to build... It gives me something to do off camera as well and play the map a bit and then think of new ideas of what I'm going to do. But we're going to kind of do this area and probably going to do it symmetrical but smaller. And then we we just decorate it with trees or, or whatever around here it's just to make it look a little bit less barren eventually all this cobble is going to be replaced hopefully maybe one day who knows when we get better access to um other stuff and then what we're going to do is we're going to just have this pond area and then we can fish and then we can also we're going to have it so we can go downwards and and yeah we, we're gonna yeah have a good time with this so yeah, once once we get a bit more breeding going on here, we should start spawning iron golems as well. So we have a better access of iron than we do now, because um, our iron, our access of iron at the moment is absolute rubbish. It's not it's not great at all. I don't even think I've got any. So actually, while I'm thinking about it, let's go and check it out. And I'm just going to check out what we've got. Um, I'm probably going to have better storage as well. Once iron and redstone become a bit more of a thing, maybe I could build a storage room. But we've only got that. I mean, it's long-winded. Uh, the only way we can speed this up is like later on in a in a, in a new seats, you know, season two or something. Is go for a mod pack. Um, that way we can speed things up a little bit maybe but I'm um, definitely going to stick to the vanilla side for at least season one so season one is definitely going to be vanilla um, and then eventually we're set, set myself up for a season two and season two will be modded I, I reckon uh, towards the end of this season I'm going to start using command blocks so yes I will be cheating in command blocks just to make things a little bit better for ourselves um, but not to the point where we're going to have everything with command blocks, I'm gonna kind of use command blocks uh, as a feat end of series sort of feature once we've kind of built loads of stuff and there's nothing really else we can do challenge wise maybe um, just to keep it a little bit fresh for that little bit longer and then series two would be definitely mods or I might just make wait for mods. I don't know. I've got so many ideas with this map. It's so noisy around here. So, what was I coming for? Let's see how much iron I got. None. See? So, yeah, building these villages are pretty much the answer to what we need to do. So, as I'm here, I might as well feed you again. You get hungry so much. You're high maintenance animals, you lot. Such high maintenance. Okay, let's go. Okay. Did that, is that three of you? Four of you. Okay, I need to grow some more plants. It's not like that's an issue. I might just do that off camera as well. Just bone mill, just do really boring tasks like bone mill this and just fill my chests up with just loads of crap. There we go, there we have it. That's pretty much what's going on. Not really a fantastic gripping episode, but we at least we're starting to get the uh, shape of the pool out. Obviously, I wanted to kind of build it a little bit on camera, as, as mundane as that was, just so that you guys can see roughly what's going to happen. So we're going to literally make a square here, and it's going to be fantastic once it's done. Um, I'm going to need to get a lot of resources off camera, so I'm going to need to get lots of wood, because um, we need to build two more of these yet. So I'm going to need about four stacks, I reckon. About four stacks of wood, maybe more and lots more cobble and then we can build that way and we're done um, when i come back to you next this will all be built apart from the the pond uh, it won't be finished but it will be in place so we'll have the hut here we're gonna have a hut here i won't build it up just yet because i want to concentrate on the fishing um, the reason i want the fishing is because i want enchanted books and name tags and all that good stuff um, you get lots of good stuff from fishing um, as well as 
the mob drops. There's there's other ways of getting really cool stuff. So guys, thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this episode, um, and I shall see you in the next one. Uh, I've got a lot of off-camera work to do, um, but I'm glad I kind of giving you a rundown of what's going on and building a little bit as we go, um, even though it's just another path. I, yeah, it sums it up. I've pretty much just built a path this episode. But you're kind of getting an idea where it's going, right? So, at least. So, we're, we're, we're in good shape. Oh, yeah. Guys, thanks for watching. Shall see you in the next episode. Take it easy.